Hello, welcome back. Well, I'm going to start off with this. What is song? According to Wikipedia, a song is a musical composition intended to be performed by the human voice. It is often done at distinct and fixed pitches or melodies using patterns of sound and silence. Songs contain various forms, such as those including the repetitive and variation of sections. Written words specifically for music or for which music is specifically created are called lyrics. Now stick with me here. Songs that are sung on repeated pitches without distinct contours and patterns that rise and fall are called chants. And that's what today's reaction is going to be all about. I've had this on the request list, I guess, for quite some time, and I'm finally getting to it. Um, I had to have the uh, link sent again because I don't know what happened to the first one. <laughs> so I did a little looking around YouTube, and other people have reacted to this. It is more, it's song. I wouldn't say it's really music per se. I mean, there's a, there's a certain emotion that comes with the chant. There's a certain emotion that comes to me, in my opinion, the way that the performer here, or the person reciting, um, takes a breath in and, and, and has such a focus that emotion, I believe, can be seen, but it's nothing that's going to be um, anything, you know, like a lot of things going on. It's uh, very repetitive, but in this, at the same time, you won't find anything like that that is so, I would say, engaging um, and done with such uh, reverence and beauty. So without further ado, this is a reaction in the in the spirit of diversity to um, experience something a little bit different and it is the emotional uh, recitation of the Quran let's get on it once again this is the emotional Quran recitation it is lengthy you will find it to be quite repetitive remember I am a person that is drawn to lyrics. However, that said, I've, I do have the English subtitles. I'm not really sure what it's going to be talking about. It is the Quran. And I did have some Islam in my uh, college work as part of my studies. That was a required course for other types of religions. I uh, graduated from a Christian university. Um, I got it, actually my degree about 10 years ago, really. And, uh, but anyway, I do have a little bit of an understanding of Islam, but I don't practice Islam. This isn't about Islam, really. This is about the actual recitation and what goes into it um, and, and just listening to the, um, the person that's doing the recitation. So anyway, here it goes. <laughs> والنازعات غرقا والناشطات نشطا والسابحات سبقا فالسابقات سبقا فالمدبرات أمرا والسابحات سبحا فالسابقات سبقا المدبرات أمرا يوم ترجف الراجفة تتبعها الرادفة قلوبه Let's take one quick pause here. So his voice is very hmm, warm. Um the one thing I noticed, and, I, and I, I don't remember the exact term for it, is the uh, sound that's guttural sound, I think they call it. I hope that's right. Um, 
so when he's uh, reciting the words, he's, he's formulating the, a pattern of rhythm deep you know, down in here. So um, that's very interesting. I'd like to, uh, anyway, I just wanted to point that out real quick. So let's do, let's go ahead and start again. Okay. <laughs> Obviously, you know, this is a very emotional for him. Um, and, and that kind of gave me chills right there. It really did. It's like, oh, um, I really enjoy actually the, the way that he's keeping a cadence, but he sets it off in the, in, like I said, within his voice with the humming, I guess you'd call it. Um, and then keeping up with the um, chant, I, I guess a song, um, as it is defined that way. So let's keep going here. Um, we're about four minutes and 16 seconds into it. My understanding, this is about seven minutes. So I did want to take a couple pauses in between, give a little bit of a reaction, and, um, and let's just keep going. All right. Let's do it. <laughs> 
فشد خلقا أم السماء بناها رفع سمكها فسواها وأغطش ليلها وأخرج ضحاها وأخرج ضحاها والأرض بعد ذلك دحاها أخرج منها ما والجبال أرساها متاعا لكم ولأنعامكم فإذا جاءت الطامة الكبرى يوم يتذكر الإنسان ما سعى وبرزت الجحيم لمن يرى فأما من طغى وآثر الحياة الدنيا وآثر الحياة الدنيا فإن الجحيم هي المأوى وأما فما قال ربه ونهى النفس عن الهوى ونهى النفس عن الهوى فإن الجنة هي المأوى يسألونك عن الساعة أيان مرساها فيما أنت من ذكرنا Okay. We better take another pause here. Just to break this up a little bit, it does sound very repetitive, but listen to um, when the, um, the vo vocals are done, like humming, it's kind of in the head voice or nasal voice and I'm not a trained vocal coach or anything <laughs> but you can just hear it but watch his expression through by the eye kind of movements that you know you can see that he's when the breath comes in that there's the um, the way that he's putting forth this effort to um, do these words. The thing about these words is that they are they're they're all over they're they're up and down. Um, a lot of the notes are going up and down the whole time, and I would not imagine that that would be something that would be easy to do. I don't think it would be. Um, but anyway, let's go ahead and finish. We've got about that much more of the uh, recording video yet to go. And then we'll wrap it up. thank Mashre MS. I'm not sure how to say it, but thank you for the recommendation. I hope everyone did enjoy the beauty of song and how it can be applied in different ways in our lives. Again, this is not about religion at all. It's about song 
and um, the diversity that we should embrace um, when we're exploring new things. So once again, thank you. Sorry it took so long. Uh, I know there's, <laughs> I get a lot of these. Uh, remember, I work two jobs and I get one day to do everything. So uh, it's sometimes quite the challenge, um, but it's what I enjoy doing and this is something I'd like to do more of, actually. I think someday when my situation gets a little better, um, ideally, this would be, you know, more of a full-time thing for me. So, anyway, thank you again, and uh, I'll be back with more reactions. So, thanks for watching.